In this video, I'm going to show you how to answer the 2023 Maths Method Sample Exam 2 Question 7. We've got one way of implementing Newton's method using pseudocode with a tolerance level of 0.01 .01 is shown below. The pseudocode is incomplete with two missing lines indicated by an empty box. Which one of the following options would be the most appropriate to fill the empty box? The formula for Newton's method is this, which basically estimates the x-intercept of a function based on the previous estimate. To have a tolerance level of 0.001 means that we want this algorithm to stop when the difference in distance between the next estimate and the previous estimate is less than 0.001. In other words, x of n plus 1, which is the next value, minus the previous value x of n has to be less than 0.001. Now we need to be careful here, the difference in distance can be in both the negative and the positive direction, and so it's important to consider both the positive and the negative values of this difference, and so this also has to be larger than minus 0.001. By considering both positive and the negative values, this algorithm can accurately determine when the difference between the two estimates is going to be within the specified tolerance level and stop going through the while loop. And so if this condition is met, then we want to return the next value, which is x of n plus 1. Looking at the code, this part is just defining the variables, and this is Newton's methods formula. And so inside this box, we need an if statement where the algorithm is going to check to see if the distance between the two estimates is less than 0.001, and then output the next value. And if it's not, it's going to continue the while loop. And so looking at the options, only option E has the correct code. And that's it for this question. If you guys found this video helpful, then give it a thumbs up or comment below and let me know. And consider joining the Maths Methods Club where you can watch video solutions similar to this one to pass Maths Methods exam questions where all the questions are grouped by topic. Thanks for watching and this was the end of the multiple choice section.